Hey friends, or my beautiful tiaras, it's your girl Tara Plays, but you can call me Tara, and we are back here today with another episode of the Sims 4 Family Dynamics Challenge. In today's episode, we do have a couple things planned. As you can see, our girl really needs to go to the bathroom, so I'm going to let her um, go ahead and do that. Well, you know what? Actually, let's start with the pregnancy test. <laughs> so, there's a little bit that I need to catch you guys up on. Um, one being that Estella might be pregnant. <laughs> so, um, over the course of last episode and this episode, I, well, one, I updated her um, house a little bit, like, she has a different toilet. I kind of traded some things out so she could have more money because we were like poor. And then I got her a double bed, her little um, closet. We also have a new member to our family that I need to introduce as well. Um, we have a little love seat couch now in our living room. And yes, our garden is thriving as well. Got some new plants that we have um, added to our garden. But <laughs> I'm going to let her take the pregnancy test and let's see. I don't know. I thought they used protection. I don't remember. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Thank God. I really thought she was pregnant, guys. I mean, I was going to go with the story regardless. But, um, yes. So we met um, our new neighbor. He lives right next door over here. Um, his name is Zachary. So what happened was um, Estella being the friendly cook she is, <laughs> she um, cooked or baked him a cake or a pie or something. We baked him something and we brought it over because he was new to the neighborhood and uh, Stella was just trying to be friendly and they actually hit it off really, really well. So um, they're our best friends. This happened in the course of like six hours when Estella was over there. Um, she thinks he's attractive and we also have some sentiments. So Estella thinks Zachary is responsible, deeply, they're deeply connected. She finds him very adoring and he gave her a um, really nice gift. And Zachary actually has a crush on Estella, thinks she's interesting, and also has a deeply connected sentiment. So that, um, one thing led to another when she went over there to visit him, and they ended up um, woohooing. And I really thought Estella might have been pregnant. So that's, <laughs> that would have been crazy if she was. I mean, I wouldn't be mad because I do low-key want them to be together. I know, girl. Go to the bathroom. Um, what else happened off camera? We have not gotten a raise yet. And I gave Trinity a makeover as well. I kind of want to have a dinner party tonight. Um, because we do have to have five gold dinner parties for this challenge. I don't even know if we have enough money to throw a dinner party. So we have a dinner party happening tonight at 5 p.m. Um, and then, where is a uh, little Brutus? <laughs> so, we have a new member to our household. This is Brutus. <laughs> He's so cute. Um, I just figured getting Estella a little puppy or a dog just because she's so lonely and doesn't really have anyone since we're just starting out. And Brutus is lazy. Um, he is playful, a couch potato, and vocal. <laughs> He's so cute. A couple of other things happened off camera as well with Estella. Why don't you like watch TV? You're just literally sitting here. <laughs> Um, a couple other things that happened with Estella is she also discovered, or she had a self-discovery of the self high maintenance trait. So it says these sims require extra work to keep in good condition. Their problems sometimes appear tribal. It may even appear out of the blue. These struggles can be remedied, remedied through mindful habits, which puts them in a state of catharsis. <laughs> 
Um, and then Leo. The whole reason I even pursued Zach is because Leo here, who we had a blind date with, <gasps> she actually thinks he's unattractive now. Wow. They're best friends. Um, but they slept together and he gave us a WTD that she's actually getting over. <laughs> so I was like, I don't think we're going to be messing around with Leo anymore because absolutely not. Yay! We just got promoted to head dishwasher, guys. So it looks like we are going to make an additional $1 per hour, which is six, $16 per hour in total. We got $334 bonus and we got a countertop that we're going to sell. Right, let's buy a sleep replacement because she's absolutely exhausted. <gasps> Zachary wants to go on a date. You're coming over. And <laughs> we'll go on a date tomorrow. All right, Stella. Let's change into your party outfit. Now, we are definitely going to have to um, ask Leo to just become friends because I don't need her flirting with Leo in front of Zach. Absolutely not. And probably shouldn't woohoo with Zach because we have a WTV. Which also sucks. <laughs> okay, looks like our first guest is Leo. <laughs> I... Should probably talk to him before everybody else gets here. Please don't flirt with us. Oh my gosh. Girl, no, 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 no. Okay, let's ask to just be friends. We're gonna turn that down. No one else is here yet, though. No, okay. Do not intimately slow dance with him. Ask him to just be friends. Where is everybody at? Oh, Trinity's here. And she's just standing outside. She's like, I think it's best if we just um, be friends. And if you didn't know, you did give me a WTD, and I ain't about that. <laughs> Let's do some wine. Let's do some whatever that is. And hopefully people will grab a drink. Let's make lasagna el pesto. That sounds yummy. Oh, Leo's getting a glass of wine. Yes, sir. Help yourself. <laughs> Very sophisticated. Oh yeah, this is um, this is Trinity's makeover, guys. She's so cute. <laughs> I love her so much. Oh, Leo's talking to Brutus. <laughs> I'm gonna tell um. Trinity to introduce herself to Leo. Oh gosh. Oh, now everybody wants to come in here at once, huh? Oh, she said, wow, so I wasn't aware that you felt so strongly about Zachary. He seems like a good company. I'll chat with him soon. And she finds him quite pleasing. Yay! All right, everybody, let's come eat. All right, here we go. <laughs> We should probably thank everybody for coming. Aw, we got a sentiment with Trinity. That's our BFF, man. Pretty sure they're best friends. Yeah, they are. This is so cute. <laughs> this is so cute. She already has a gold, um... She already has a gold dinner party, so we already got that. What is this? What just popped up? Chemistry. Zachary's character and vibes do not speak to Trinity at all. She simply feels that they are completely incompatible with each other. Ooh. <laughs> That's not good. Well, Trinity doesn't like Zach, so that might cause an issue <laughs> if we end up marrying him since she's our best friend. Like you definitely want your best friend to like your boyfriend or significant other. All right, we're gonna make a strawberry cheesecake for everyone. It's 11 o'clock, oh my gosh. <laughs> we haven't even really talked to Zach either. 
We have a cute little friend group. Oh no. I forgot that Zach's lactose intolerant. And he got a buff that says, oh no, now he's feeling sick. Oh. Oh no, everybody smells. He's like, I gotta go to the bathroom. <laughs> he had like a happy love saying he was like thrilled to get a taste of lactose and then now he said it's not worth it. <laughs> oh my gosh, that is too funny. Let's grab a drink with our girl Trinity. Leo is literally smoking a blunt. in the middle of our living. Can you at least go outside? That's so rude. Oh my gosh, look at Brutus sitting, sleeping right next to Zach, like he belongs. Okay, we have to go to the bathroom. All right, we haven't been able to talk to Zach all night. So I do wanna come in, give him a little flirting. She's like, how was the food? So like, it was great, thanks for having me. He's a foodie. She wants to get into a relationship, so maybe I'll have them end up together. I don't know, I don't know. Oh, Trinity's coming in. She's like, what are you two doing in here? <gasps> they can have their first kiss. Oh my gosh. Wait, I want them to have their first kiss, but I want to be like in secret. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Zach is giving us a suggestive look. Of course we're gonna accept it. He's feeling very flirty. I feel like he would probably kiss her. Let's offer her a rose. <laughs> oh, stop. All right, let's give her a steamy kiss. They're having their first kiss. Oh. Man. <laughs> that was very intimate. <laughs> Yay, that should count. Oh my gosh, what's he doing? <gasps> Wait, what? Did he just ask? <gasps> Guys, he asked us to be his girlfriend. <laughs> and now he's asking for... <laughs> Obviously, we're gonna let them say yes. That was crazy. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I'm gonna end the, the, the gathering. She's like, okay guys, it's time to go. <laughs> oh my goodness. That moved very fast and she wants to have a child. Oh my gosh. That's insane. All right, they are all done. They didn't woohoo, they were just like kind of messing around on the couch. Um, but Estella got this buff that she is ready to have a child. And I think that's really interesting. Um, I mean, for this generation, we do have to have kids pretty quickly. So they are together. <laughs> I kind of want to ask him to move in, but I'm not really sure. They're just partners. They're not in a relationship. Um, and then we have quite a few buffs, so let's go over them. So she has, she's feeling really confident right now. Um, he's gotta go home. <laughs> it's like four o'clock in the morning. Uh, okay. Bye. <laughs> So we have um, host masterpiece from hosting a party to invite to invite to entertain and to charm. The host who has succeeded at these may take pride in a job well done. We have scrumptious from eating really good food. We have cured of trichomania. She was. We have this that she got cleared of her WTD and it was a successful treatment. Discover thyself. Um, she also has a buff. First kiss. New partner. 
astonishing aroma for drinking really good wine, feeling fulfilled. She has some really good buffs. All right, girl. She's like cleaning the shower or cleaning the sink. All right, I'm gonna end the episode off here, you guys. Um, we didn't end up going on a date with Zach, but I don't think we needed to since he autonom- autonomously asked us to be his partner and um, they woohooed as well or they messed around a little bit. So I don't, I think their chemistry is really good. Let me know what you guys think about Zach down in the comments below or if Estella should still keep dating around. Um, she does want to get into an actual relationship and she wants to have a child as well. So we got to get the ball rolling so our girl can start her big happy family. Um, if you made it to today, to the end of today's video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. If you aren't subscribed already, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And if you never want to miss when I upload, go ahead and ding that notification bell. I love you all and I'll see you in the next video. Bye guys.